Drinking alone at home is better than drinking in public. I'm not making an ass out of myself in a bar. I'm not on the road drunk driving to get home. Not leaving my car in a shady parking lot and getting an Uber home. And having to get to my broken into car the next day via another Uber. Not paying three times the price for alcohol. Not having to come home drunk and get into bed with all my makeup and clothes on. Instead I'm shower fresh and in my pajamas in my cozy bed. Just at home on a Friday night downing some drinks and causing no problems for anyone. I often drink alone in my shed. I like to look at my stuff. Tinker. Talk to my dogs. Watch stuff on YouTube and in winter have a nice fire maybe cook my dinner out there. Get a little blasted. Head off to bed. I love it. Doing no harm to anyone. Maybe just my liver. The older I get, the more I prefer drinking at home either alone or with some friends. Whenever I share this with people, they always seem to have some sort of concerned expression on their face like they're deciding whether I'm an alcoholic or not. Couldn't be bothered either way. Music sounds so much better after a few bevs at home. In Finnish we have word for that kalsarikanit drinking home alone in your underwear without intention to go out. Or maybe just have two or three closest friends. But yeah I would prefer drinking or doing edibles alone at home rather than in public. Funny reading this comment as I hold a glass of wine in my hand at home sitting alone watching TV. 100,000 agree, drinking at home is superior. I just wrapped a pint and a half in my basement. I don't need to be drunk. But I like to have a good beer stretched over a couple hours of bad Netflix and random web browsing. In fact, it's about the only escapism I have that doesn't disappoint me these days. It's safer, smarter, and significantly cheaper. For me, going out and drinking is something that is fun but also somewhat stressful and energy consuming. A whole variety of little things can just ruin my whole night and make me feel like crap when I'm drunk. That's the kind of person I am. Being at home in my pajamas, sitting back and having some drinks is completely different experience, pure relaxation. Fully agree. It's far cheaper. Don't have to get dressed and I'm surrounded by all my stuff so I have tons of things to do. I also tend to drink less. At home I'm only looking to feel relaxed and enjoy myself. Going out I tend to drink a lot more just to deal with the sheer boredom and feeling of not wanting to be there. Drinking alone is the shit. A bottle of wine and some video games? Forget about it. You've hit Valhalla, baby. Agreed. Mega agreed. I thought I was the only one that felt this way. But it's literally the best take a hot shower. Put on a great TV show. Have a great cocktail. Chef's kiss woman cooking kiss mark. Not paying three times the price for alcohol. This one is what seals the deal for me. As a DJ this is something I deeply agree with. Drinking in public is a pain in the ass. Ubers are expensive. People get rowdy. The only time I had fun drinking in public was Vegas. And that was only because the hotel was a five-minute walk from the club I'd much rather get drunk at. Home and play some video games lol. I totally agree but frequently drinking at home alone is a slippery slope that can lead to addiction. I started out five years ago with having a bottle of wine few times a week and now I am drinking a bottle of vodka daily. Just saying. It takes longer to get addicted to it compared to other hard drugs but it's very sneaky. Look for the signs I have taken substances known to be highly addictive GHB. 4MMC. Speed. Benzos. Coke. Opiates and I can manage my usage of them easily but I can't kick off alcohol and nicotine from my life which are the most accessible drugs take care cherry blossom. Before I got pregnant I loved getting tipsy drunk at home with my partner. 
maybe have a cocktail or two with dinner but come home by half ten and carry on drinking just us two. Watch some good TV or a movie or reminisce on old music. Even as a teen twenty-something I much preferred house parties or staying in. Going out is expensive and overrated. For the most part, I totally agree with you. Being home ensures. I save money. Stay out of any possible trouble and don't have far to go if I get too intoxicated lol. But every so often I do enjoy getting out to a pub and enjoying the atmosphere. Yeah, it's pretty great. I like going out as well. But love drinking at home. Sat and watched Once Upon a Time in Hollywood in 4K on my new OLED the other night while sipping on some orange mango rum and it was awesome. Isn't drinking alone a sign of never mind, have fun. Laughs in public transit. George Thorogood enters the conversation. Lol majority of people on Reddit are antisocial. So this is nowhere near unpopular here. I almost exclusively drink home alone. A couple light beers with a book. I hate drinking in public. I prefer doing it in my home. By myself. Alone. At 12 a.m. while everyone else is asleep. Word man. I don't have a she's but my hubs is working late and I have a bottle of 90 Evans Williams and some. Pineapple juice so I'm set. Finally someone says it. Clearly not an unpopular opinion. It's better until it's just not anymore. Then it's usually too late to turn back. I hope you don't get to that point BC it's a slippery slope. One drink at the end of the day out on my balcony. Infinitely better than happy hour during the week. I love a drink or two out on the weekend with friends but a single drink on a weeknight is great at home. Although I agree. I think this is unpopular since I get shit for it. So upvote from me. Agreed wholeheartedly. It's just some haven't admitted yet they are an alcoholic and call it socialization. Others don't have a large enough house to have a pool table in it and enjoy pool. I agree. In public you also have to cope with all the stupid things people say. I still remember so many stupid things that I heard people say. And you can't help but feel that everybody is an asshole. Nothing is worse than being confronted with human stupidity and you brought it all on yourself. At least when you're home alone you can take it easy. Drinking with friends is great and all but my fav times are drinking while I'm cooking a big meal. And in the evening, enjoying a glass of bourbon while putting together a Lego set or playing video games. I personally can enjoy both. Definitely safer at home though. There's moods for both. At home if you want some solo time but in public if you're with friends. That's the way I see it. I enjoy drinking alone because it lets my mind wander but when I'm with people I stay focused on them. Not sure why people freak out at drinking alone. Not everyone drinks to get drunk or make socializing easier. Some of us actually enjoy the drink for what it is. After a long day of work. Getting the kids to bed. A single malt whiskey is best enjoyed alone. Usually with some YouTube and gaming. I would say entertaining friends at home and drinking together is best no overpriced drinks. Crowded bars. Dazed commutes back home. But you still get the joy of company. Drinking alone though. I can't help but think is a little sad and can set you onto a path to alcoholism. A drink or two on a Friday night is all good. But if you're regularly getting drunk by yourself. Then it can become a coping mechanism and you slip into addiction. Agreed my boyfriend and I do it all the time lol. Cuddling. Chit chatting. Watching our shows. Getting in some cardio. Also won't say no to a couple glasses of wine when I'm home by myself with a book or a show after a long day of work. I like company when I'm drinking.